Hello friends. In this video we will discuss the water supply engineering subject. Multiple choice question answer. Let's start. Welcome to our channel. Civil Engineering Basics. For more videos please subscribe, Civil Engineering Basics. Which of the following practice causes reduction in the per capita water consumption? Metering system practice causes reduction in the per capita water consumption. The rainfall cycle period in India is taken as 35 years. The rainfall cycle period in India is taken as 35 years. The rainfall cycle period in India is taken as 35 years. The multiplying factor, as applied to obtain the maximum daily water demand, in relation to the average demand is 1.8. Note, maximum daily demand equals 1.8x average daily demand. The total water requirements of a city is generally assessed on the basis of maximum hourly demand. Maximum daily demand plus fire demand. Greater of above. The distribution system in water supplies is designed on the basis of peak hourly demand. Coincident drift. The distribution system in water supplies is designed on the basis of peak hourly demand. Coincident drift. As compared to the geometrical increase method of forecasting population, the arithmetical increase method gives lesser value. Note, rate of change of population with time is assumed to be constant in arithmetical increase method. The suitable method for forecasting population for an old developed large city, is arithmetical mean method. The suitable method for forecasting population for an old developed large city, is arithmetical mean method. The pipe mains carrying water from the source to the reservoir are designed for maximum daily draft. The pipe mains carrying water from the source to the reservoir are designed for maximum daily draft. The design period for design of water supply project is generally taken as 20-30 years. The design period for design of water supply project is generally taken as 20-30 years.
In India, as per Indian standards, water consumption per capita per day for domestic purpose is 135 litres. In India, as per Indian standards, water consumption per capita per day for domestic purpose is 135 litres. The growth of population can be represented by a logistic curve. The growth of population can be represented by a logistic curve. The growth of population can be represented by a logistic curve. The per capita per day demand of water is taken as an average value over a period of one year. The per capita per day demand of water is taken as an average value over a period of one year. The suitable method for forecasting population for young and a rapidly developing city is geometrical mean method. The suitable method for forecasting population for young and a rapidly developing city is geometrical mean method. In India, rainfall is generally recorded at 8 a.m. In India, rainfall is generally recorded at 8 a.m. In India, rainfall is generally recorded at 8 a.m. If the average daily water consumption of a city is 24,000 cum, the peak hourly demand of the maximum day course will be 2,700 cubic meters per hour. If the average daily water consumption of a city is 24,000 cum, the peak hourly demand of the maximum day course will be 2,700 cubic meters per hour. The rainfall at any place is described by its intensity, its duration, its frequency. The rainfall at any place is described by its intensity, its duration, its frequency. The quantity of water retained by the subsoil against gravity is known as specific retention. The quantity of water retained by the subsoil against gravity is known as specific retention. Hydrology is the science which deals with surface and underground water. Hydrology is the science which deals with surface and underground water. Hydrology is the science which deals with surface and underground water. The surface runoff is due to rain in the net supply interval. The surface runoff is due to rain in the net supply interval. 
The surface runoff is due to rain in the net supply interval. Hydrograph is a graphical representation of discharge flowing in river. Hydrograph is a graphical representation of discharge flowing in river. Hydrograph is a graphical representation of discharge flowing in river. Thank you so much for viewing this video. For more video on civil engineering subscribe my channel. Civil Engineering Basics